Chick Thea's 1 kilogram. Baking Soda 1 TSP. Soak the chickpeas overnight in enough water to cover them. I soaked a little more than 2 cups. And in the morning, I had around 5.5 cups of it. Drain the water in which you had soaked the chickpeas. Oil 1 half cup Onion 2 medium Tomatoes 5 to 6 Red chili powder 2 tea bees Coriander powder 2 tea bees Salt 1 TSP or to taste Turmeric powder 1 TSP Ginger garlic paste 2 tea bees Green chilies 1 half cup Fresh coriander 1 cup Make a tomatoes and the onion paste Take a walk. Drain the chickpeas and add them to the tomatoes onion mixture and the all spices. Stir till all the chickpeas are coated with spices, around 2 minutes. Do not throw away the water once you have drained the chickpeas. We will add the same water in the gravy. Mix, 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 mix. Cover and decook till chickpea is tender. Add roasted coriander 1 tablespoon. 1 tablespoon roasted zira and the 1 teaspoon kasuri methi. Add water, cover the pan, and let it simmer at medium low flame for around 30 minutes. The gravy will thicken after 30 minutes, so add water accordingly. I do not like thin gravy with chow. It's done. Yum!